welcome to another episode of Check Out Basket. Today we're checking out another new item from Hungry Jacks that's just come up on my menu. And it is the Grill Masters, that's right, those Grill Masters, the big ones, Pulled Beef and Angus Burger. It comes in a nice big box like so. Let's have a look what's inside it. The box, that is. There we go. The burger comes in a lovely burger nappy. It's because it's part of their bur those kind of burger ranges. So we'll just take off the nappy. There we go. Alright, so inside this burger it's supposed to have mayonnaise, mustard, smoky barbecue sauce, pulled beef, the Angus beef patty, uh, Egmont cheese, toasted brioche buns. Alright, so you can see the lovely brioche on top. We'll pop that over. You can see the uh, the mayonnaise, mustard and smoky, smoky uh, barbecue sauce and the pulled beef on that side. You can see on this side it has the Angus and the Egmont cheese melted into the bottom of the brioche bun. Alright, let's reassemble this. Get my trusty knife. One, two, right the way through. Three, four. Now you can see the pulled beef at the top. The nice Angus beef patty at the bottom. Alright, now I've cut this one in half. It's time for me to give half of this to my offsider, who sits off camera, who helps you and me figure things out. And I think uh, the assistant of the taste tester wants to try this burger as well. That's right, it's taste test time. All right, so in front of you, you should have half of one of these Grill Masters burgers. Now these are thicker, juicier Angus patties. Mm -hmm. And this one is the Grill Masters Pulled Beef and Angus Burger. Pulled so beef and Angus. in this burger, you have mayonnaise, mustard, the smoky barbecue sauce, yeah. pulled beef, yeah. the Angus beef patty, right. Egmont cheese on their toasted brioche buns. Now, it's a different type of bun top, you can see. Yes, it's it is. Nice, right. nice and it's softer too. Doesn't have any sesame seeds. Oh. All right. This one comes to a, a grand total of $10.50. Oh, wow. One burger. Ouch. Now, it is a little bit smaller than what you would expect from a Whopper. It did have a nappy on it, and I've got uh, pulled yeah, beef. Yeah, well, the nappy's all right. Yes, yeah, great. All right. Shall we go in? In for a taste. Different taste. Definitely different texture. The buns are softer. Mmm. You can taste the two different types of beef in there, yeah. with even the texture, because of the the pulled beef is is stringy, and the Angus patty is juicy, and 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 and, and beefy. It's all beefy, but it's all it's even better. All right, I really can't taste the difference of the cheese, really. What do you think? I like it, because I do like beefy things. Time to give it a score. Like you say, I don't know about the cheese. Yeah. I can't tell the difference between this cheese and another cheese on this burger. No. I think it's lost with the beef. I think this the, the, the pulled pork, or is it pulled pork? Or pulled beef. Pulled beef on it is quite nice. Um, the patty is quite nice. It's juicy. Oh yeah, and it's thicker than the normal patties too. If you notice. Yeah, it's uh, it's not bigger though. Now remember, it's ten. It's ten dollars. I'm I'm giving this down to a to a to a three fifty three point three point five. All right. Well, I think yeah, I think you're pretty good on the mark there. I'm I'm impressed. Yeah. But not overly impressed. Ten dollars fifty, maybe the burger should be a bit bigger. Personally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, it's gonna get a three and a half out of for, from me too. So you've given it a three and a half, and a three and a half from me. That's seven out of ten. If we get you to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, see you in the next video.
It's still very juicy though. Mm. Yeah. Very doesn't doesn't have the zing of the of some of their burgers. No. No. But it doesn't it has it's not dry out, dried out. No, either. but it doesn't have the zing. No, it doesn't have the zing. And I think that, um the smoky barbecue sauce is, is, is good in there, but I don't think it's enough. And that pulled pulled beef, I don't think it has enough seasoning in it. Just for me. Mm. Oh well. It's alright, I don't mind it. Yeah. Just maybe a few different different uh different things done to it, it might make it a little bit better. Mm. 